Okay, man. So, Jazz Praying sends Honeycomb Brazy a powerful message. And when I've seen this on social media, I was like, damn, bro, it's about to get crazy. So, right here, we have this message from Jazz Prince. He said, let's see how tough they really are. One thing I learned is if you keep letting people play with you, it will never stop. Now, when I seen this message, I was like, who is he talking about? Now, note this, bro. Jazz Prince is a kind of ninja that never spoke on stuff. You know, he never come on social media to do all those cloud chasing and stuff like that. So when I've seen this message, I was like, yeah, he, he might be talking about some crazy, right? Because this dude is not the type of dude that come on social media and chase cloud. He never talks. Now, for some of you all who don't know who Jazz Prince is, Jazz Prince happens to be, you know, one of the sons of Jay Prince, right? You all know Jay Prince, Mob Ties and Rapper Notes and stuff like that. So Jazz Prince happens to be the one that discovered Drake and got Drake to sign that record label deal with cash money and young money. So it's crazy, right? He's an OG in the industry, right? For, for putting Drake in the position of power in the music industry. So let's get back to the message. Now, you know, I asked a lot of questions about who Jazz Prince was actually talking about because we always want to get the word on the streets right so i reached out to some homies from houston i was actually trying to ask some questions now crazy bro some people are saying that he probably talking about brazy because remember i mean brazy was talking about him when he was out here he was still showing brazy some love and stuff like that but you know brazy never cared about none of that i mean brazy got a lot of respect for him but you know we're trying to find out what's really going on because when I checked out on, on Instagram to see what Brazy is up to, I seen Brazy trying to reach out to J Prince, right? After Jazz had this message on his Instagram story, I was putting two or two together, trying to find out what's really happening, right? If what the street is saying, if it's really true. So when I seen Brazy trying to reach out to J Prince, I was like, bruh. It might be, you know, making a lot of sense that, you know, jazz was just falling out with, with Brazy. I mean, it never happened before. So I would say this allegedly, right? I would say this allegedly, but, you know, it makes a lot of sense, right? Now, jazz being in the music industry, being in the music business, you know, he owns mob ties with, with Jay Prince, you know, Jay Prince Jr. and all these people from Prince family. I mean, he's a real OG. I mean, dude has a lot of money. Remember, when when Jazz was falling out with Birdman, right? Birdman refused to pay Jazz Prince some money, you know, that that Drake generated for cash money and stuff like that. When his dad came in, Jay Prince Sr. came in and decided to step into the issue, you know, that was millions and millions of dollars. That's not cheap money, bruh. So when I say Jazz, he, he's really rich. I mean, dude is really rich, rich. So a very big shout out to Jazz, bro. Now, this is allegedly. So we're still talking about this situation. Make sure you subscribe to this channel and turn on notification bell because I will be doing a different video. You know, how I kind of put two and two together, go out on the street to see that, you know, Jazz was actually talking about Brazy in this message that he was sending out. Now, Brazy kind of responded by trying to reach out to J. Prince Sr., right? So check out my next video, bro, because it's going to be making a lot of sense. Now, bro, the industry is really crazy, right? It's about the money. It's about the business and stuff like that. So we had, you know, Brazy in, inside prison trying to expose mob ties, trying to expose J. Prince Sr. and all these people saying that, you know, they hired the security that got him locked up and that situation was really going crazy and we all saw what was going on, right? We all saw it on the internet and it was really crazy. But at the end of the day, we have to realize that Brazy is actually in a position that he doesn't know what to do, right? So he's just falling out with everyone. He was trying to do what he have to do because that's frustration. I mean, you never been in a situation that you don't really know what to do, bro. You get what I'm saying? You don't know what to do. All you have to do is to express your frustration. Now, when you're trying to express your frustration, you have a lot of people out here who is going to misunderstand your frustration 
because you know they see it as arrogant they see it as he's trying to be rude they see it as he's trying to fight them and stuff like that i think that's the position that brazy is right now and i think jazz prince actually had enough of brazy because he never thought you remember when you know prince family went on that interview with a million dollar worth of game and you know jazz prince wasn't there bro mike prince was there i think jay prince jr was there and jay prince you know was there but jazz prince was never found remember jazz prince was the person that was doing his birthday party the day that they invited take off right but he wasn't there bro we never see him in none of those videos you know you never see him nowhere close to take off and and quavo and all these people he never he never showed himself there man because he's right he's like brothers with quavo right he never showed himself so that's to show you how cool this dude is so when he started falling out and sending out this type of message i was like bro this must be serious let's talk about this on this channel now let me know who you all think that jazz was talking about right let me know under the comment section because when a man comes up and say let's see how tough they really are and he said one thing i learned is if you let and keep people play with you it will never stop so he will not stop people from playing with him or stuff we never know bro but remember this video is for entertainment and educational purposes so everything is allegedly smash that like button subscribe to the channel and